Hey, what's up, you guys? We're back at it again. This is our fashion shoot, and we're going to show you guys how to rock denim jackets. We have the black one here, and we have the blue one here. Yes. This is Mike, and this is Dee, and I'm yeah. strong. And today, we're going to give you guys styling tips to look fresh to death. Yeah. yeah. So let's start it. All right, so we got our first model here, Mike. He's rocking the, uh, the blue denim jacket with the distress. And here, when you rock with the denim, these are really great pieces that you can layer with during the fall and winter season. And they, they're great accent pieces that will definitely make you guys stand on the crowd. And this piece, you see his look, Mike is definitely layering. He's rocking his Yeezus Tour merch shirt along with the flannel with the distress bottom. And of course, he tops it off with the, the denim blue. And as you go down, you see that he's rocking. You see that the length of the, the flannel is longer than the shirt. It's, it's give, given this distance between the pants and the shirt and the denim jacket, which makes it look very layered and it looks good. So it pops out. So if, if he didn't have this flannel, it would just go from denim to lighter denim. And that would look a little bit tacky, but the fact that he has this flannel and the black shirt even, it creates this, this breaking. And the breaking is good. When you're usually typically when you wear a piece like this, you you definitely want to keep. If you're not gonna wear something that breaks it apart, you gotta definitely keep it where you're wearing a black skinny jeans with the distress. But here, this this bit definitely looks well and works well because the denim is more stonewashed, and you have these these uh, stonewashed where it's a little bit more distress and you have these rips which are definitely the punk rock style that's super in right now. If you want to show off your rebellious style, you've got the rips right here. And of course you got the Yeezys. Uh, Mike is working the Yeezy to kind of complement the fact that he has his uh, Yeezy shirt, uh, shirt merch right here. Of course. Boom. So we'll, we'll show Mike turn around real quick and you see the back. So this is the back and you see this beautiful layer right here. You see that there is the, the the denim jacket and then you have the flannel shirt with the black shirt that and as you can see as he's walking in the back these are the small details people are going to notice the fact that there's these different layers and texture within his his bit makes it look real stand out these are the small details that tells people that you're very conscious about fashion and of course it shows that you have a taste level which stands above all others so so that's the back side and this is how it looks and it looks great you can tell that these are the small details that people are going to notice and it's going to help you stand out above other most people have this one or two layers even mostly it's really low key just one layer but you're this is the fall and winter season if you want to stunt on people you definitely want to show off your layering and no there's no better way than rock it with these different layers so you have the denim jacket the flannels and the shirt all right Mike you can turn around real quick and this is a this is our first look and you top it off with a hat you got the low cage you have with the space bill Mike is looking super clean let's do a full body scan real quick again you got the hat from up top you have the amazing hairstyle you have the the distressed denim jacket you have the distressed flannel and you have the tour merch, tour merch. fit it with the fact that it's slim through the the legs and the pants and you have you finish off with the Yeezys and make sure if you're rocking the denim don't be afraid to go loose with it so this one this this look you have Mike rocking it is slightly shorter than his arm but it works if you have a flannel that's long hem you can always rock the flannel past the wristband right here and it creates this layering look through the arms but this is style within itself. You can definitely get denim jackets which are more longer, shorter. But this one just has to be shorter. It's just a style, it's just a look. And I feel like Mike looks great. Mike, how do you feel about this? Well, I picked it up myself, so I feel like I look fantastic. Look at this. It looks great. Swaggy. <laughs> it's just my personal style. Um, I'm known for my layers normally, how I do my clothing. Mm -hmm. It's just a normal, regular fit for me. That's awesome. Boom, we'll go on to our next look right now. So we're here with the second look and D is our handsome model today. And today he's rocking the distressed black denim. So you, we've had the blue denim that's light, now we have the black denim distressed. You have a lot of details here that really stands out. I really like the fact that this denim jacket is, is roughed up. It has the rebellious theme. You know, you can look like James Dean off of Rebel Without Society, <laughs> without what cause. And you got these cuts right here. You have these distress, you have these cuts here. And it really kind of just, it spells out your personality. You can tell like, you know, Damon's been through a lot of tough, rough situation, but he came through out it breathing, so. <laughs> no, it's, it's really awesome. Of course, you're rocking the, this is a little bit, it's more simple, this is more casual. You're not layering too much, but again, this color though, is a standout color. You're not gonna see this color a lot, and this is a desert sand color. So, this is, this, 
it goes really well with breaking apart the black on black that he has here with his joggers. And as you, you pan out right here, you can see that he's complimenting his entire fit with the Y3 Kazas, the Kaza Highs. These are beautiful. And this is definitely a standout piece, as usual, with all the pieces that we're showing you guys how to style and, and we're giving you tips for, you're going to stand out. It, whether it's subtle or whether it's intricate layers, this is something that people are gonna look at you when you carry yourself in public and it's going to scream confidence. Mm -hmm. Now let's, we're just gonna say the first impression visually is gonna be confidence, but definitely carry yourself with your personality and charisma and show it all the way. Of course, you know D is full of that, right? Oh yeah. <laughs> so we'll show, we'll show. Oh yeah, of course. Let's point out the detail. If you got a watch, this is a Nixon gold band watch right here. Very beautiful. It t it shows you're on your grown man status, and you ain't messing with no low key status. <laughs> hey. And now uh, D, got to point out the small details right here. D's rocking the uh, pyramid uh, nose piercing. Definitely something that. If that's what you guys are into, this is what those it small details, it spells out confidence. I mean, that's all it does. So we're gonna show you the back of your look real quick. And this is the back, of course, you got the, the distress again. And these are the things that spells out rebellion. And that's that's a great thing to have. Uh, if you're, you're not in your business attire, your suit, which we'll do in a future episode, but this one is about looking trendy and hip with our current fashion trends, which is more thug, mysterious, rebellious, rock star. And you see a lot of looks like this. You, you probably catch looks like this on artists like Travis Scott, Young Thug, Chris Brown. And this is definitely something that we're, we're trying to showcase where you have these pants right here. This is this is interesting right here. You, you're you seeing this denim jacket come right here, getting it's having this break with this sand, desert sand shirt. And now you have this drop crotch, skinny pants, joggers. And that's unique too, because usually you'll have it skinny all the way through your uh, crotch area, but this is the different style where there's a slight drop, drop crotch to it, where it's, it's just a different fit, different silhouette. It's definitely unique. You can play, you can mess around, you can mess around with that, and you can play with the different variations and forms. This is just another form. If you saw in the previous fit, fit that we had with Mike, he was wearing a very skinny jean that fit his silhouette. He's a skinny guy, and it looked great on him. And of course, D is a D is more built up top, so he's definitely it, this. He's wearing a less loose denim jacket, which is showing more of his form and showing off the fact that he's a little bit more built. And but I would not, I, it would you would not go wrong with going a little bit looser. Mm -hmm. And we'll show that style here in, here in a bit. But yeah, this is a great look. D, tell me, what do you think about this? Uh, I love this look. Honestly, I mean, I'm a blackout kind of guy anyway. Mm -hmm. uh, to me, black don't symbolize nothing about negative, it's positive to me. Yeah. Uh, personally, I just love this jacket in general. I mean, the jacket is just, it's lit because you can be able to wear it during the summer as well as during the winter. Yeah. And you always wear it with any, almost any kind of style you put into it. Yeah. So, it don't always have to be like, um, you can wear black on black on black. That'd yeah, be you okay. Can, you can wear that could. black with pink. Like, yeah. you can go any kind of colors. There's yeah. no uh, certain type of color with black. That's yeah. one thing I like about black. Yeah, so, definitely. Yeah. yeah, D brought up a great point. Black is is a good color where you can definitely wear it all black. Mm -hmm. Now, don't think just because you're wearing blue denim, you can rock denim on denim. No, no. Mm -hmm. Don't do that. That's mm -hmm. not good. So make sure that if you're going to rock a blue denim, keep <laughs> it black or keep it white or keep it broken up with a layering piece. Mm -hmm. But do not have blue on blue. That's tacky. Don't do that. We've all made mistakes doing that. But we're showing you here today, so you guys don't. Yes. So we're gonna move on to our third look. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's get it. Hey guys, we're back with the third and final look in the denim series. So uh, we have Trung here. Uh, Trung is rocking the black denim jacket. It's a little bit wider fit than the denim jacket we had earlier. Um, as you see here, he's layered up uh, with the camo print underneath. Um, also, he has a white layer. Now, that's attention to detail. Um, a lot of people are going to look at that and they're going to see the separation of the two blacks which we talked about earlier. Uh, you've got your, your lighter denim here and another denim pant on the bottom, the black and black, which is totally fine to rock. Uh, but he has it separated with still this darker scheme. He's got a little bit of earth tone in the camo print with a, still that black theme, but he kind of throws it off with the white, which is good. I say throw off, but I mean he, he offsets it. Offsetting is perfect uh, in the fashion world, in the fashion industry. So um, also, let's just go ahead and stay here. We've got a little bit of distress here in the jeans. 
popular style. It goes down to a slimmer fit. Uh, he has the uh, Adidas NMDs on. Um, those are seriously a have to item. Uh, if you don't know about them, definitely look those up. These guys are a go-to item right now. Adidas, I would say, is definitely up in the fashion world now. So, um, let's pan back up. Um, turn around for me, Tron. Um, as you can see here, um, it's still a wider, it's showing a little bit broader build for him. So, um, that's another thing with confidence. Broad shoulders, that's uh, a sign of elegance. This is a sign of strength. So a broad look, a wider set jacket, a bigger, a heavier overcoat on the outside is a, a sign of strength, if you will. So um, just looking here, you can also still see from behind what most people will see in this. Um, they're still gonna see the multi-layers um, from the jacket, the black. You'll see again the, uh, the camo print and then also the white layering again. But it's just a simple silhouette here on the back. It's very, very simple look black you got your your different pattern your white and then your black again so it's very very simple look awesome so uh Chum, how do you feel about this fit i don't typically wear the baggy up top because uh, for me since i like it a little bit more slim this is a little bit over baggy but honestly it's really in style right now because of thanks to brands like yeezy and vitamins and fear god they're really bringing this baggy look for the winter which as long as paired up with the slim look on the bottom so it's honestly i'm feeling really cool with it you know i definitely rock this around you know have hands in your pockets kind of like rocking and of course when you take it off you know you can always sh you know show off you know, your shirt absolutely and you, absolutely. you know this is definitely something that stands out is it's more this is definitely a worksman attire it feels like a worksman attire and it's like i just got off my work uh you know building construction buildings yeah, and stuff like yeah. that but no I, I like it a lot the camo gives it a street look. This tiger camo and this, the white shirt is a great way to, to separate the blacks in the camo mm -hmm. and the other black. Absolutely. Oh, wow, I like it, man. Yeah, awesome. it's fresh. All right, guys, this wraps up our denim series. And there we have it. We just finished up our denim, denim jacket guide. And this is D, and this is Mike. They were amazing models. We hope that with these tips, that you guys have an idea of how to style yourself. But at the end of the day, wear what you like dress how you feel so if you guys have any other questions about what you guys would like to see in the future when it comes to fashion and you need some tips let us know comment below if you guys like any of the look or have any opinion of what else we should wear also let us know and definitely if you already hit that like button go over here and hit that subscribe button for more and just keep looking good <laughs> hey you know hey 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 you know all right, you guys, thank you guys for watching. Peace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what needs to say it. Yeah. Because he said, if you already hit the like, I was like, well. Yeah.